Have you ever looked up at a spiral galaxy and wondered what holds it all together? It's a beautiful, swirling collection of stars, dust, and gas. But when scientists first measured how these galaxies spin, they found a massive puzzle. The stars on the outer edges were moving way too fast. Based on all the visible stuff we can see, like stars and nebulae, these galaxies should be flying apart. The gravitational pull from the visible matter just isn't strong enough to keep them from disintegrating. So, what gives? There must be something else out there, something we can't see, providing the extra gravity needed to bind everything together. Scientists gave this mysterious substance a name, dark matter. It's called dark because it doesn't emit, reflect, or block any kind of light. It's completely invisible to all our telescopes. We can't see it directly, but we can see its gravitational effects on the things we can see. Think about it this way. Imagine a spinning merry-go-round. The kids on the edge have to hold on tightest. If it spins too fast, they'll fly off. Galaxies are the same, but instead of kids flying off, it's entire stars. The fact that they don't fly off is our biggest clue that something invisible is providing an extra gravitational grip. And here is the truly mind-boggling part. Calculations show that this invisible dark matter makes up about 85% of all the matter in the entire universe. That means all the stars, planets, galaxies, and everything you've ever seen or imagined is just a tiny fraction of what is actually out there. The universe is mostly made of something we can't even see. Without dark matter, there would be no galaxies, no stars, and ultimately, no us. It's the invisible cosmic scaffold upon which our universe is built. We've talked about what dark matter is, but how are scientists so sure it exists? There are several other mind-bending pieces of evidence that point to its presence. We'll dive into those next time. Thanks for watching. If you found this as fascinating as I do, hit that like button and subscribe so you don't miss our next journey into the cosmos. See you in the next video.